how to create a new folder with selected items. What is up ladies and gentlemen, this is Jeff Benjamin with iDownload Blog. By far one of my favorite features of the Finder is the ability to create a folder with selected items. So all you basically need to do is highlight the items that you want to appear in that folder, right click, and then select the, the first option, new folder with selected items. And you'll notice here that it actually tells you how many items will be in that folder. In this case, I have five items highlighted, so it's gonna create a folder with those five items. And I really also like the animation that happens. It's a slick animation, and as soon as the folder is created, it's ready for input. That means that you can quickly rename that folder to something original. So I'm gonna put in test folder. So all this makes it just super easy to quickly create a folder with a custom name on OS X. Now let me undo this here. I'm just gonna Command Z a couple of times and undo that. You can also do the same command uh, using a keyboard shortcut. So I'm gonna highlight all of these files here and then I'm going to use the following command. Command Control and then N. So Command Control N, hold Command and Control, hit the N key, and that will create your new folder as well. Now the big advantage over that method, the keyboard shortcut method, is that you can actually do this with one single file. Uh, whereas when you right click on a file, so you selected this file here, this image, and you right click on it, there is no uh, option to create a new folder with this item here. Uh, so what you would have to do is select at least two items and then you get that option to create a new folder with the selection. But with the keyboard shortcut, you don't have to have more than one item selected. You can just do this with one item. So watch what happens. I'm gonna highlight this item here and use that same shortcut, Command, Control, and then N, and it creates a new folder with that particular item, just that one item in that folder like that. So ladies and gentlemen, are you using this handy feature of OS X's Finder? I find myself using it on an almost daily basis, if not daily basis. What about you? Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.